What's up, y'all? Um, it's your boy Intact again. Today, I'm going to show you how, well, what zip files are and how to use them on Fruity Loops. Now, basically, zip files is a file with multiple items in it. And on Fruity Loops, people use them to collab on beats for instance I'm gonna make a little drum pattern and send it to my homie blaze B so he can add to it and send it back so you can see now let me just make a little pattern here my little kit I've been working on but anyway just make a little pattern Just make a little pattern here. Some drums. Um, you do go to file export zip looped package and when you do this you're gonna put these patterns and these instruments into a one folder so I'm gonna save it in here save it like that then up here it saves and it's done and the person who you're sending it to you have to uh, they have to have well if you're using plugins like hypersonic they have to have hypersonic because they won't be able to use it but I'm going to send this to blaze B and he's going to add to it and send it back So when he adds to it, when he opens it, you just go to file open and just double click the zip file and open up. And he'll add stuff to it, then he'll save it as a zip loop package, then send it back and what he added will be right here. But I'm just gonna pause it till he sends it back. Intact this beat is awesome. I'm totally gonna rock out on it. Okay. Alright, now he's sending it back. And uh let me just replace it. And um I think he used hypersonic too. And I have hypersonic too, so well he said it sucks. I mean <laughs> So I'm gonna open Blaze V 
collab again and as you can see he added a plug in okay he added this piano if you will hurry up That's what a zip file is mainly used for for Fruit Loops. But well, ain't no buts, but if you have any questions, you can hit me up and I'll help you. But that's about it, but Syntax signing off. Nigga.